Hi, I'm Rex from Western Filament. We're here at iCast and we're talking about how braid is made. So basically this is a 16 carrier braiding machine. This 16 carrier braiding machine is braiding our tough line, um, high performance braided fishing line. The raw material is a UHMW PE spectra fiber. Each one of the strands of raw material is formed into a braid configuration by half of the bobbins running one direction, half of the bobbins running another direction. That's what interlocks and forms the braid. This is a 200 pound test um, tough line that we're building right here. That 200 pound test tough line um, is a uh, really, really high diameter line, but it is a hollow braid. Um, unique process with regards to the braiding process. This, uh, this uh, bobbin on the machine, each one of these bobbins again will travel in a never ending circle around machine, half going one way, half going the other. We have a green bobbin and we have a purple bobbin. The green bobbin is gonna go one direction, the purple bobbin will go the other direction. I'm gonna turn the machine on now which is gonna give you a little bit of an indication of how the braid is built. If you watch the purple bobbin, you can see it making a never-ending path around the machine. The green bobbin is making a never-ending path around the machine in the opposite direction, which gives you the interlocking pattern of the braid. This machine is running at about 25% the speed of a standard uh, braiding machine. And um, the standard ones run just a little bit faster than this, and it's kind of a little bit of a blur. Standard braiding machine is gonna build braid at about 18 yards per hour. So to make a bulk spool of line, you're looking at about four or five days of consecutive run time on that machine, 24 hours a day, to be able to build a full bulk spool of braid. 